think I'm right in saying that roughly about two weeks after Layla went missing, you started to receive some really weird requests on Cash App, is that right? Could you just tell me about those messages, the sums of money, and what those messages were saying? I absolutely can. Um, I was out, I, there had been tips left in comments, like on my Facebook and on a couple of TikToks that had been done about the case. So I was going to these different hotels and things, people, oh, I saw her here, I saw her there, blah, blah, blah. So I have flyers made up and I'm going to different places, talking to different people. I'm sitting outside the Travelers Inn in Kingsport with one of Layla's childhood friends and Layla's stepmother sends me a screenshot of a cash app request from Layla and there were just, it was just letters, it was a string of letters and we, she kept getting that, that over and over and over again for $100, $100. So I immediately get in my cash app and I send a dollar with a little note. So I'm thinking, okay, she can talk back and forth with me this way. I send a dollar and I'm like, is that you? And I get the string of letters too. Well, it takes us a few minutes, but it turns out that the letters were initials for they, they will let me go or they won't let me go, something along those lines. And we're ha trying to have a conversation back and forth with this person on the other end. I give it a break. I go inside the Traveler's Inn to talk to the woman at the front desk, and while we're standing there talking, I showed her the text, like, the screenshots, and she said, oh, that's a scam. And I was like, what are you talking about? She was like, yeah, that's a scam. That's a thing that's been happening. It's been all over Facebook. People are hacking into other people's Snapchats and, like, acting like they've taken their person and blah, blah, blah. And I was like, yeah, but my person's actually missing. Like, what's the, there's no way that's a coincidence, right? She's like, it might be. And I'm like, that's, that would be wild. Like, come on. So we contact authorities and we send all the information. Over the next 24 to 48 hours, stepmom is still engaging. Okay. I, at some point, I was like, because we had asked specific questions. Um, like, what's your brother's middle name? What's your baby brother's birthday? Like, specific questions that she would only know. This person just ignored them. If I had gotten even one of those answers back, I might have taken it like, oh, okay, that's Layla, we need to do something. But when this person was avoiding the questions that would actually identify her, I was like, no, uh -uh, something's wrong here. And then periodically, throughout the next several weeks, they kept coming in. The cash ups just kept, kept all rolling in. Um, and at first, even the authorities were like, oh, we're pretty sure it's a scam or a joke or someone's had access to our cat, blah, 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 blah. Um, but then the, the request started to get more and more threatening. Um, they were, like, being very detailed about the things that they were going to do if we didn't send the money. Or and, and I'm almost positive that between all of the conversations that we had, because you had to send a dollar to send a, a, a sentence, we probably did send the money. That's the sad thing. Um, so they did request access to that account, and it took several weeks uh, before they actually got the access and were able to pinpoint where it all came from. But they did find out where it came, point, eh, where it came from. The res residence that it came from was fully searched. She was not there. There was no sign that she ever was. It seemed to be a crime of opportunity. She had logged, Layla at some point had logged into her Cash App account from someone else's phone and never closed it back out. And at some point, this person realized, oh, Layla's missing. I could make some money off of this. So, so this is one and of Layla's friends that was sending these messages? I can't specifically say. I was asked not to... Um, speak on exactly who it was <laughs> publicly. Yeah, that's fine. I won't, I make, I won't make yeah. the same names, but... Yeah. I mean, but, um... Yeah. It, that happened. Like, it was... Added torture and trauma on top of an already terrible situation. Um, as of right now, there's no reason to believe that the person 
that did it had anything to do with her disappearance. It just seems like it was somebody who thought they could have a little 